mass casualty event playing out during one of South Korea's biggest gatherings since the start of the pandemic. People were crushed and trapped as large, large crowds squeezed into narrow alleys to reach the bars in the capital of the Seoul's nightlife district. ABC's Christine Sloan has the latest. <laughs> Halloween festivities in Seoul, South Korea turned deadly Saturday evening. An estimated 100,000 people had gathered for the country's biggest Halloween celebration since the coronavirus pandemic began nearly three years ago. The crowd had gathered in an area filled with bars along narrow alleys off the main street. According to witnesses, people became trapped and crushed as the crowd pushed into those narrow alleys. American Janelle Story has been living in Seoul since 2016. She was out celebrating a friend's birthday and captured some of the chaos on video. I just saw in front of me this mass of people like running and pushing and like moving fast and and screaming and and like panicking. I think we're so shocked because I usually feel so safe here. All I can think right now is just the shock of it. According to the National Fire Agency, the victims were largely in their 20s. At least 90 ambulances were dispatched. One witness described the harrowing scene, saying it looked like things that happen in a war. I think the people were not prepared enough, this man says. There were way too many people. National Security Advisor Jake Sullivan tweeting, the United States stands ready to provide the Republic of Korea with any support it needs. President Biden issuing a statement saying, we grieve with the people of the Republic of Korea and send best wishes for a quick recovery to all those who were injured. Christine Sloan, ABC News, New York. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV and Roku to watch on your TV.